Now, for a number of weeks, Hillary's been talking up an outdoor structure she's been building in the backyard, a place where she can escape from the family and have some quiet time. A man cave, if you like. Hmm. I guess you could call it a lady cave, because it's for a lady. Anyway, I thought it was about time she showed us around. I'd been dreaming of a she shed since lockdown. Glamping in the backyard to escape the family sparked a need deep inside. The she shed is underway. Can't reveal too much. Needless to say, we've got a lot of candles and essential oils. Oh, you've got to go candles, oils. Um, I imagine some beautiful towels. Yeah. Um, and I'm thinking some kind of relta foot spa. <laughs> The problem is, I'm a bit behind. As you can see, the construction's all done, but I haven't had time to decorate, and there's a hell of a lot of painting to do. Oh, look at that. I wanted a cottagey feel, so I've gone for Dulux Lake Heron. That's gorgeous. Of course, I'm going to prime it first. I'm just going to slap that on. I love painting. It's so relaxing. Nothing as boring as watching paint dry, so this should help. Right, time to put the blower down and decorate. This place needs a bit of tarting up. Hi! Lovely to see Hi. you. Nice to see. This is amazing, isn't it? Come on in. Thank you so much. A foot spa. Yeah, a foot spa. That's perfect. Well, I thought you'd like it. It's perfect for the lady cave. It's a she shed. OK, sorry, she shed. Let me show you around. Some places to sit. Mm-hmm. Susan DeVoy's World Championship squash racket. Is that... Broken. Is that actually Susan DeVoy's racket? Yep. Wow. Yeah. So we've got our nice scented candles over here. Do you want to read a book? I've got Hillary Clinton's. Yes. Marilyn Waring. Um, oh, or, or you might like to. Feminist Theory. Feminist Theory. Okay. Small oh. book. You um, don't have sort so of. There we go. So you can a Richard choose Hadley book or anything, do you? You can sit here or you can sit over there, wherever you like. Where's the big screen TV? No, don't need one of those. Family photos anywhere? Or? No, no family photos because I come in here to get away from them. Oh. Maybe you should build a man shed at your place. A man cave. Well, I can come here and be in your lady cave. <laughs> you cannot come to my she shed. Why? That's the whole point of this. It's just for me to get away from everyone, including you. Really? Yeah, I mean, no offence, but it's just for a bit of serenity. Just be and listen. There you go. I see what you're trying to do with the theme, but I just would have thought a little bit more feminism. You're not tempted to hang up some bras or something around the place? Could do. Or half burnt ones. Yeah, burnt ones. That's what I'd do. Or maybe even just a fire over in the corner mm. that is fueled by burnt bras. Could do that. Hey, look, I'd love to have you stay for longer. Just a. He's the only man that can stay in here. The boo. Oh, I like that pose. Here we go. A little homage to the boo. It's been great to see you. But as you go, do you move a bit of that mulch? I'm going to move the mulch. Yeah. All of that? Yeah, do you mind just... Because I haven't started on the landscaping. That's part of phase two. It's a new dawn, it's a new day. Can you give me a hand? I'm a bit busy. I can see that. <coughs> it's sitting there with your feet in the bloody stump. Always having to do the bloody hand graft. Things are going to change. One day, I'll tell you. Take the power back. Mm. 